One of my primary concerns going into this was the ability for five and six year old children to be able to wear their mask in a learning environment around their peers and being tempted to remove their mask, to communicate with their peers and to also communicate with us. That concern is no longer valid, which is great because they come in every morning, they find their spot, they start working, they follow the hand washing protocols, they also are very diligent about making sure that their mask always hides their nose. All right, very good. There have been no need for reminders to wear their mask. They keep their mask on all day and we are loving every moment of them being able to follow those safe guidelines for continuous education. It's easy to be able to see the children when they are projected at the back of the classroom. And then while I'm teaching from the front of the classroom, the children at home can see me as well. They can hear me. Three and a seven. A three and a seven, They're, thank you. They're included throughout our entire day. From home, let me get uh, Pierre and uh, Evan. And then in the classroom, let me get Audrey and Reed. We need to make 37. We are doing the same thing that we normally would do, even if we had all of the students present. For example, one of the activities that we do here at Hoven Run is a Pumpkinville rotation. Tomorrow we will still be doing a Pumpkinville rotation, except it will be virtual. The children at home will be able to participate and the children here in the classroom will also be able to participate. So we are keeping learning going at the same pacing as well as including as many of those fun, engaging activities as possible. And you all have the same poster at home.